is Tom DeVecchio, your weather authority. Well, this is the warm day, no doubt about it. Checking things out on our Physical Therapy and Balance Center's weather cam. And, uh, oh boy, it gets hot. Uh, already uh, 87 at the airport right now. And uh, here at our studio, similar temperatures. And we're just past the new and noon hour. We have all afternoon yet. Now, as you check things out, uh, we are picking up what appears to be some very light showers uh, right now in northern parts of Lake Erie. Uh, I don't even think these will hold together. I don't think they'll be uh, a big problem for us as we head on into the afternoon. Uh, but temperatures again on the high side. We're going to get close to 90 here for many of you for the afternoon. After that, cold front moves through tonight. Noticeably cooler tomorrow. We're getting back actually close to normal and uh, much drier, more comfortable air for your outdoor activities, but not so chilly that you know, you're know you going to have to have long pants and a sweatshirt or anything like that. Upper 70s and near 80 Saturday and Sunday. July 4th, heat and a little more humidity come in, uh, but we'll keep it dry. Could see some showers and storms still warm on Tuesday. So, uh, pretty humid for today, and then we'll drop down uh, to decent humidity really for the weekend. Uh, outside of maybe some early showers on Saturday, you just can't beat uh, the kind of weather that we are expecting here. So, 82 Niagara Pier, uh, 88 in Greenfield. Adam, oh, sorry, forgot your temp. Uh, Waterford got it. Uh, I remember you're in the mid 80s, uh, nice and warm there. At the borough, 84, 82 in McCain. Farther inland, uh, 86 in Meadville. Kathy's got our uh, Mike actually has 87 out towards Sagertown and Kathy for that matter. In Youngsville, Kathy, the other Kathy, has 86. So dew points uh, back up into the low 60s. Not muggy, not as high as we thought it would be. And so I think our thunderstorm threat for the afternoon, not quite as bad. But if you have any plans for the weekend, this is the hot one today. Uh, again, Saturday and Sunday, pretty good shape as far as the temperatures go. Uh, and on Monday for July 4th itself, we'll keep it dry as well. So uh, here are the clouds, frontal system off toward the north, making very slow progress to the south. And the clouds may gradually increase as we head on into the afternoon, though. 90 is still possible. Future cast, you can see by uh, evening, we may start to see some uh, storms develop here, getting more prominent uh, as the evening goes on. Another round possible close to midnight, but by uh, daybreak tomorrow, things start to end. We clear out. Northerly winds will bring us that drier but still fairly warm air for the rest of the weekend. So mostly sunny, breezy, and warm this afternoon, uh, then becoming partly cloudy later on. Highs uh, around 90, uh, maybe a few isolated storms developing late in the day in the mountains and in the inland section. Your temperatures near 90, maybe even the lower 90s for some of you. Some showers and storms at times for tonight. Not a drought buster, but we'll take anything we can because it is very dry. Early showers around, then clearing tomorrow noticeably cooler and drier as high temperatures get close to 80 degrees and for Sunday mostly sunny upper 70s low 80s a little more humid for July 4th and we're keeping it dry rain holds off until Tuesday